Welcome back guys, and this will probably be a shorter video. I'm kind of running pressed on time and it took us ages to find the match. But uh, I'm built a mono blue mill deck, and we're going to see how it goes. <laughs> That's basically the gist of it. Uh, we we see guys revenge, we lose. We see plated crusher, we lose. <laughs> That's generally how it works there. I actually had a game before, which I actually made a little short video on, but unfortunately it corrupted. Where uh, I got the guy down to one card, he top decked the guy as revenge and won. <laughs> That was uh, not my not my finest moment. You know what, I'll keep this hand slow as hell. We don't have any mill, we don't have tutelage. I mean we don't have any we don't have a tutelage, but we do have mill technically. But uh You know we do have ways to delay. We can adverse conditions and then if we do draw into a counter spell, we can exile it. Something and then this comes online. So yeah, this deck's janky as hell, I just threw it together, played I think three matches, won one, lost two. Dominated the AI though. If you, if you want a deck to beat the AI, this is it. Because uh, they normally only run like one red source <laughs> in like a deck which is pretty much mono red for some reason, and uh, they run like five color. They run, and you know what you need to counter. You just counter that turn two. Uh, what's it called? The blue white guy that gets better with planes. And then uh, you counter the <laughs> counter the razor foot griffins, and then you gold. But uh. Typical when just as I'm like pressed for time this guy decides he doesn't know what land is and he doesn't know how to play it What rank are you? You're 19. You're pretty much higher than me. I think I'm 24. Yeah So you, sh you should know what a land is by now unless uh, everyone you've been playing has been significantly worse Hey, horribly rise a great draw there I don't think I'd counter a, I don't think I'd counter a Gate Cooper Vine. Although I could just counter something just because I can get it back with the reclaimer, but uh, this is this is annoying. <laughs> Lord, please play land. It's not it's not the most difficult decision. But I'm back at home now. That's why I'm kind of pressed for time. Uh, heading out soon to see some old friends, and it's going to be very emotional. See, I haven't even given this deck <laughs> a box or a name yet. I'm I'm homeless. Cheers for the day. Yeah, I'm, I'm gonna let that slide. I'd rather count this. I mean, I've, it's not like I'm doing anything next turn. So. I'll be able to just hold it up next turn, and then, uh. If I don't draw a land, I'll probably get this tap land out of the way so I can hold up adverse conditions or talent of telepath. But we drew a land, so. I'll be fine. I don't need to try and not play the Skyland Cascades until, uh. Like, we absolutely need to, or it's gonna interrupt our tempo. I mean, right now, what would we love to count here? Uh, you can count up to something that costs four or more, so it's, it's good for two more turns at least. And it's only creatures as well, you got to keep that in mind. So, uh, what would I like to count uh, <laughs> Three drops. If we had Undergrowth Champion, that would be a pretty good counter, but we don't. And I'm in a weird mood today. I'm pretty tired, it was, <laughs> it was a long journey home. <laughs> and uh, this guy's taking the piss, so I'm just chatting shit. Generally, what you do. If anyone, if anyone ever decides to make magic videos, this is the worst part. When they are just deciding that they don't know how to play land, and then you just have to keep talking. <laughs> but no, every draw step that he's just playing Geki provides is technically a. It's technically we've milled them for one. <laughs> Come on, this is taking the piss now. It doesn't take half your time at each turn. Rochambler, do you want to counter that? It gets bigger each turn, but we don't, honestly we don't have any much. That thing's only being a 1-1. One, one, unless he starts removing his own stuff, because obviously Mono Blue doesn't really have any kill spells, so I'm fine with that. This is... this is... How, how does it take this long to play a land? That, he must have friends over who are analyzing each play. And, uh, I mean, I'm tempted to just tap off a talent of the telepath, try and hit three acid monsters and pull this guy. <laughs> Obviously it doesn't work like that anymore, you know, he, it, ne it never worked like that actually, but th I think they did fix the, the whole spell mastery shenanigans. But uh, this is, this is not where you want to be when you when you press for time, he's taken his whole turn time to play a 1-1 two, a one -one for 2 mana. Hey, second main, we're getting there. <laughs> oh, this is, this is... This is just dreadful. But I can't, I can't even like cherry pick and like choose 
choose who I want to play right now. Uh, like, look, that, that's how you take a turn. You just play your land and you pass. You don't sit there for half, half your turn time. And play. I don't know. I'll calm, I'll calm down as soon as this guy decides he wants to actually play the game. If it was chat, I'd be I'd be flaming this guy right now. <laughs> I miss chat. Hey, he played a land. Really? Oh god, this guy's this guy's here now. He got me. Now he's got a creature on the board. He knows he he's taking the advantage. Hit me with that acid mass a day. Well, we can tap that thing down next turn with the Skyland Cascade. Not, 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 not that I'm excited to do that, but hey, a play's a play. And then, uh, I don't know. Start tapping down stuff with adverse conditions. I'd love to see some card draw. And I think it wouldn't. How hard can it be to implement like a turn timer? Like, just say it starts off five minutes, but if you take three minutes and it goes down to you, only have three minutes sort of thing. Instead of this, which is just. I'm, t I'm tempted to go for the talent of the telepath, but I'd honestly rather get the spell mastery up before I do that. I normally try and cast this as like a 7 mana, so you can keep a counter spell up at the same time. So I mean, I'll probably just try and blow this horribly awry, maybe then in adverse conditions, and then take it from there. Try and hit 2 acid moss, blow this guy back. <laughs> That's the only reason I'm running this. It's not actually for the mill, it's just for the dream of me hitting 2 acid moss. There's land number 5, hopefully he doesn't play a 5 drop creature. Come on, hit me with something good which I'd like to counter. <sighs> yeah, I'm just not even going to talk now during the, this guy deciding to wait. I'll probably just pause and then wait until this guy comes back. So see whenever he joins again. Who said I'm not good at editing? <laughs> Uh, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. So yeah, he took just just to the end of his turn timer right there, so that was a good two minutes shaved off. And uh, I'll pause until his turn starts. Like, this is the thing, if I wasn't playing the blue deck, I could just pause out his entire turn. Because there'd be nothing I'd be doing on his turn, but... Uh, I don't know, I've got like one finger on the pause button and <laughs> one finger on the uh, space bar for pause, but I'll, I'll pause until this guy comes again. This is so like inconvenient, but at the same time, I really don't have time to get another match. So uh, yeah, see you in a sec. This is what I'm talking about, by the way. That was, that was literally like five minutes for me. I should really just leave and just not upload today. But uh, and I'm I'm nothing if not determined. And hey, we found our tutelage. What do we want to get rid of? Honestly, I don't think we need two Ulamogu Kalamas. Okay, so we can actually play magic now, hopefully. So this guy can't just try and time stall us. Get the tutelage down, we have horribly arrive. He has a reclamation sage to try and deal with that. We have no we have plenty of stall, we have a claustrophobia, we can get stuff back with all the mugs play my next turn. Get our counter spell back if we need to. Tap down his stuff, we've got some mill here, so uh, things are looking up. That guy's just played a land and he attacks for one, that's generally Hey Acid Moss, I can't do anything about that. But, uh, so I think this guy has decided he's the biggest prick in the world. Time stolen and acid moss. So, congratulations to him, I guess. There's the reclamation sage, so fuck you, sir. <laughs> Please just leave. I'd honestly rather play the eye at this point. Because he's, he's, he's not going to take his turn now, so I'll see you when my turn starts again. And predictably, he literally time stole me for the rest of that. But uh, screw it, we've got his name on camera now. That's the main goal here. Do we need six mana? One, two, three, four, five. So what does six do for us? Nothing really. I'd rather honestly tap his thing down. And I'm gonna go turbo mill here. Go for talent the telepath. I've got no counter spells, screw it. I've got claustrophobia if he does play a big scary guy. So yeah, fun fact here, I think talent the telepath is bugged. Because look at the text there, it says choose up to two instants. The first spell you choose will be the first to resolve. So logically for me that says you play Fiery Impulse, then Wild Size. So Fiery Impulse will resolve first, then Wild Size, but uh, as you'll see here, Wild Size resolves first, so I've got to keep that in mind. 
I'm not sure if that's just me reading wrong or uh, just being stupid, but uh, that's how I interpret it anyway. We nick Nissa there, that's pretty nice. And uh, I don't know, things are looking up, I guess. What have we hit from Sim so far? We've got two bombs, well, actually, we've got Geyser Revenge, that's pretty nice. Brick of Armies meet Claustrophobia. We've already seen one Reclamation Sage, normally people don't run too many more than that. So, and he looks like he's decided to start playing magic. Congratulations, my friend. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So we can claustrophobia and talent the telepath again. That could be pretty nice. So we'll talent first in case we get some sort of like into the maw of hell. Exquisite firecraft. I mean, actually, no, we can't kill anything, but I'll, I'll cast both of these, might as well. Uh, fire impulse can kill us O2 and run enough firecraft to the face might as well <laughs> not gonna burn him out obviously but uh can start tapping his stuff down as well he's down to 24 cards in his library looking at my hand here I can Ulamog's reclaim I get back adverse conditions to tap down some more stuff so I'm feeling relatively com confident here. As long as he doesn't have a geyser range. Some sort of landfall trigger. Oh, the firebird. That's annoying. Uh, luckily he doesn't have the reclamation stage, otherwise we'd actually be very close to death. This next turn I'm just going to tutelage, keep up adverse conditions, I think. I'm trying to mill him out as fast as possible now. Displacement wave. Not the best. Get him to tap out, I guess, and he has to. The thing's got haste, so. I think this is the play. Because if he does find some way to remove something, then uh, we can we can get there. I think. It's gonna be a close game either way. I'm just glad this guy decided to uh, actually stop paying attention in the game now. What have we milled? That'd probably be a good idea to check. So we got quite a few of his bombs. Could get one guy's revenge, which is fine, which means he's probably got the second one in his deck. And as I said at the start of this video, uh, this deck just loses 100% to guy's revenge. I mean, there's there's really nothing we can do about it. There's nothing in mono blue I think that can really touch it. We've got Hydro Lash, so we can make it a five power creature for a turn. That's all we got. This isn't this isn't where we want to be in this guy's Omnath is a major problem. <laughs> and he's got the land. Uh, so I mean that's something we're gonna be tapping down next turn on his turn. This is gonna be a close mill. I hope have to hope to hit him pretty hard here, because I'm gonna leave that 3-3 because we can tap down the five fives. Displacement wave for zero, I've got to remember get rid of the tokens. So I've got to keep that in mind. The 5-5 is going to be an issue though. I want to wait for him to accumulate mul multiple tokens. I don't mind taking 3 for a turn. He can't uh, Ravaging Blaze us out. Rolling Thunder could just end us here, but... Uh, I don't know. So we're going, to be, we're going to be taking down to 16 minimum. We can definitely survive another turn, hopefully. Unless he has the Rolling Thunder. So we can get him down to 12. We draw a card. That gets him down to 8. So it's going to be close either way. Spell Shovel's nice, even though he is packing quite a lot of mana. Okay, we're going down to 16 there, so that was some good mills. And then, uh... Make sure I tap these things down on his attack step. The two elementals, and then he takes us down to 8. He can burn us out now, but we do have a Spell Shovel if he does go all that way. Make sure I can't displacement wave for three, otherwise that breaker of army comes online. Gotta to, got to remember that. Place the land, that's good. Wanna get as many lands out of his deck. Desolation twin. Uh, we are definitely on, on, on Brick's Edge right now, I think. Okay. Tap down, tap down. Honestly, I don't know why I didn't fucking spell shrivel there. I just cost myself the game. I'm not paying attention. Yep. 
Perfecto. Hey, we can bounce a token though, but we bounce our own token as well. We are definitely <laughs> pushing our luck here. Hydro Lash is it's a card, I guess. I don't know why I didn't spell sure that thing. It gave him a 10 10 for no reason. Okay, we've got 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8 mana. Can displace me for 2 here, gets rid of creatures. He'd be left with a 10 10 and a 5 5 and a 3 3. Then we can. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. Little Mogs Reclaimer will chump the 10 10, but we still take lethal. We just, we, I think we have to hail Mary in the mill here, don't we? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. So I think if we actually hit a land, we can potentially win. Because then we can Hydro Lash as well. We do not, but hey. Uh, what's it called? Alchemist Vile's good. If we get if we get multiple mill here, we win. Nope, not that turn. Not that turn. Come on, come on. <laughs> this is it. Hit two cards. Hit two cards. Hit two cards, please, please. No. Yes! Yes! <laughs> I was such a cunt. <laughs> oh god, that's the best movie magic I've ever played. <laughs> oh god. <laughs> I can't breathe. <laughs> oh, we even get to buy a pack. <laughs> oh, I'm so glad I decided to stick that game out. Oh god. <laughs> oh, I've misplayed that so bad. I don't know why I didn't counter that creature. I think I could have like definitely won the game because I could have. That's brilliant. I'm glad it played out that way. Got a Hellkite. Nothing there I like. That was the shittest pack ever. But screw it. <laughs> Thank you guys for watching, and I hope you enjoyed because I definitely did. See you guys later.